Hi, today we're going to talk about basic console navigation. Touching the top con icon opens the About Mini View. To make full screen, swipe Mini View from left to right. To restore back down, expand another Mini View the same way. Or touch on the Expand icon if present in the Mini View. To close the Mini View, touch the left pointing arrow at the top of the Mini View. The Guidance icon opens the screen you're currently seeing. The Satellite icon displays GPS information. Submenus provide position, orientation and accuracy. You can see details of current satellites in use. HDOP and HRMS, the lower the value indicates the better the accuracy. System Diagnostics icon contains submenus for memory usage, console diagnostics, trouble codes and logging. Job Information icon contains submenus for job statistics, job duration, job settings, guidance settings and job notes. Touch anywhere in the job notes to open the virtual keyboard. Recorded notes appear on PDF report. Auto section control icon. Use the control mode slider to set to avoid overlap 0 or avoid gaps 100. Boundary limit sets which type of boundary limit will turn off application when using auto section control. ASC turns auto section control off or on. If configured, a virtual switch box can be used for manual control of section switches. Implement icon. The implement icon is determined by the implement profile currently loaded. This example shows a CEDA controller. Tap, the Topcon Agriculture Platform Cloud-based Farm Management Service. Universal Terminal. Access to any attached ISABUS compatible equipment. Inventory Manager. The filing system or data storage. Items are stored by category and can be deleted, renamed or copied both to or from USB. The spanner icon takes you to the setup screen. Touch the running man to return to the run screen. Status monitoring panel displays status of the virtual switch box. If enabled in the setup screen, this allows manual control of sections. Press and hold an object for half a second to activate select mode. Once engaged, select mode icon becomes visible and the object is highlighted. Touch to select. Available for editing boundaries, removing or changing flag points, control traffic guidelines and water conservation benchmarks. Map panning can be enabled in the setup screen. This places the map panning icon at the top of the screen. Touching the highlighted icon recenters a panned map to the current location of the vehicle. Select visible map layers to choose which coverage and information layers will appear on the screen. Selectors are used to choose if a VRC map is displayed and also the type of coverage information. Toggle map view mode. Perspective view provides perspective with a virtual horizon. North up view, the top of the screen represents north. Overhead view, the top of the screen represents the vehicle's current direction. Map zoom. Select minus or plus to zoom out or in. Press and hold to zoom quickly. Implement master switch. Turns product application on and off if virtual master switch has been enabled and set up. Auto steer engage. Turns auto steer on or off. Touching when red, open steering status window if enabled and set up. And that is basic console navigation. I hope you found this video helpful and have a nice day.